The United Nations Commission on International Trade Law French Commission des Nations Unies pour le droit commercial international was established by the United Nations General Assembly by its Resolution 2205-21 of 17 December 1966, to promote the progressive harmonization and unification of international trade law. UNCITRAL carries out its work at annual sessions held alternately in New York City and Vienna. History When world trade began to expand dramatically in the 1960s, national governments began to realize the need for a global set of standards and rules to harmonize national and regional regulations, which until then governed international trade. Membership UNCITRAL's original membership comprised 29 states, and was expanded to 36 in 1973, and again to 60 in 2004. Member states of UNCITRAL are representing different legal traditions and levels of economic development, as well as different geographic regions. States includes 12 African states, 15 Asian states, 18 European states, 6 Latin American and Caribbean states, and 1 Oceanian state. The Commission member states are elected by the General Assembly. Membership is structured so as to be representative of the world's various geographic regions and its principal economic and legal systems. Members of the Commission are elected for terms of six years, the terms of half the members expiring every three years. As at 3 July 2017, the United Nations Commission on International Trade Law will be composed of the following member states. Africa Algeria 2016. Burundi 2022. Côte d'Ivoire 2019. Kenya 2022. Lesotho 2022. Liberia 2019 Mauritania 2019 Mauritius 2022 Namibia 2019 Nigeria 2022 Sierra Leone 2022 Somalia 2017 Uganda 2022 Tanzania 2062 Zambia 2019 Topic Asia India twenty twenty two China twenty nineteen Indonesia twenty nineteen Iran twenty twenty two Israel twenty twenty two Kuwait twenty nineteen Lebanon twenty twenty two Japan twenty nineteen Malaysia twenty nineteen Pakistan twenty twenty two Philippines 2022 Singapore 2019 South Korea 2019 Sri Lanka 2022 Thailand 2022 Topic Europe Armenia 2019 Austria 2022 Belarus 2022 Bulgaria 2019 Czech Republic 2022 Denmark 2019 France 2013 Germany 2013 Greece 2013 Hungary 2019 Italy 2016 Lithuania 2019 Poland 2012 Romania 2016 Russia 2013 Spain 2016 Switzerland 2019 United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland 2019 Turkey 2022 Topic North America Canada 2019 El Salvador 2019 Honduras 2019 Mexico 2019 Panama 2019 United States of America 2022 
Topic: Oceania. Australia 2022. Topic: South America. Argentina 2016. Brazil 2022. Chile 2022. Colombia 2022. Ecuador 2022. Venezuela 2022. The methods of work are organized at three levels. The first level is UNCITRAL itself the Commission, which holds an annual plenary session. The second level is the Intergovernmental Working Groups which is developing the topics on UNCITRAL's work program. Texts designed to simplify trade transactions and reduce associated costs are developed by working groups comprising all member states of UNCITRAL, which meet once or twice per year. Non-member states and interested international and regional organizations are also invited and can actively contribute to the work since decisions are taken by consensus, not by vote. Draft texts completed by these working groups are submitted to UNCITRAL for finalization and adoption at its annual session. The International Trade Law Division of the United Nations Office of Legal Affairs provides substantive secretariat services to UNCITRAL, such as conducting research and preparing studies and drafts. This is the third level, which assists the other two in the preparation and conduct of their work. Activities UNCITRAL is Coordinating the work of active organizations and encouraging cooperation among them. Promoting wider participation in existing international conventions and wider acceptance of existing model and uniform laws. Preparing or promoting the adoption of new international conventions, model laws and uniform laws and promoting the codification and wider acceptance of international trade terms, provisions, customs and practice, in collaboration, where appropriate, with the organizations operating in this field. Promoting ways and means of ensuring a uniform interpretation and application of international conventions and uniform laws in the field of the law of international trade. Collecting and disseminating information on national legislation and modern legal developments, including case law, in the field of the law of international trade. Establishing and maintaining a close collaboration with the UN Conference on Trade and Development. Maintaining liaison with other UN organs and specialized agencies concerned with international trade. Conventions. A convention is an agreement among participating states establishing obligations binding upon those states that ratify or accede to it. A convention is designed to unify law by establishing binding legal obligations. To become a party to a convention, states are required formally to deposit a binding instrument of ratification or accession with the depository. The entry into force of a convention is usually dependent upon the deposit of a minimum number of instruments of ratification. UNCITRAL Conventions The Convention on the Recognition and Enforcement of Foreign Arbitral Awards the New York Convention 1958 The Convention on the Limitation Period in the International Sale of Goods 1974 The United Nations Convention on the Carriage of Goods by Sea 1978 The United Nations Convention on Contracts for the International Sale of Goods 1980 the United Nations Convention on International Bills of Exchange and International Promissory Notes 1988. The United Nations Convention on the Liability of Operators of Transport Terminals in International Trade 1991. The United Nations Convention on Independent Guarantees and Standby Letters of Credit 1995. The United Nations Convention on the Assignment of Receivables in International Trade 2001. The United Nations Convention on the Use of Electronic Communications in International Contracts 2005. The United Nations Convention on Contracts for the International Carriage of Goods Wholly or Partly by Sea 2008. The United Nations Convention on Transparency in Treaty-Based Investor State Arbitration 2015. The United Nations Convention on International Settlement Agreements Resulting from Mediation The Singapore Convention on Mediation 2018. Model laws 
A model law is a legislative text that is recommended to states for enactment as part of their national law. Model laws are generally finalized and adapted by UNCITRAL, at its annual session, while conventions requires the convening of a diplomatic conference. UNCITRAL Model Law on International Commercial Arbitration 1985 text. Model Law on International Credit Transfers 1992. UNCITRAL Model Law on Procurement of Goods, Construction and Services 1994. Uncitral Model Law on Electronic Commerce 1996 Uncitral Model Law on Cross-Border Insolvency 1997 Uncitral Model Law on Electronic Signatures 2001 Uncitral Model Law on International Commercial Conciliation 2002 Text Model Legislative Provisions on Privately Financed Infrastructure Projects 2003 Uncitral Model Law on Secured Transactions 2016. Uncitral Model Law on the Recognition and Enforcement of Insolvency-Related Judgments 2018. Uncitral also drafted the Uncitral Arbitration Rules 1976 text. Revised rules will be effective August 15, 2010, pre-released, July 12, 2010. Uncitral Conciliation Rules 1980. Uncitral Arbitration Rules 1982 Uncitral Notes on Organizing Arbitral Proceedings 1996 Topic <coughs> Clout Case Law on Uncitral Texts The Case Law on Uncitral Texts System is a collection of court decisions and arbitral awards interpreting uncitral texts Clout includes case abstracts in the six United Nations languages on the United Nations Convention on Contracts for the International Sale of Goods CISG Vienna, 1980 and the Uncitral Model Law on International Commercial Arbitration 1985. <laughs> <laughs> Legislative guides A legislative guide aims to provide a detailed analysis of the legal issues in a specific area of the law, proposing efficient approaches for their resolution in the national or local context. Legislative guides do not contain articles or provisions, but rather recommendations. Legislative guides are developed by the Uncitral Working Groups and subsequently finalized by the Uncitral Commission in its annual session. Uncitral has adopted the following legislative guides. Uncitral Legislative Guide on Privately Financed Infrastructure Projects 2000. Uncitral Legislative Guide on Insolvency Law 2004. Uncitral Legislative Guide on Secured Transactions 2007. Uncitral Legislative Guide on Secured Transactions, Supplement on Security Rights in Intellectual Property 2010. See also United Nations General Assembly Sixth Committee Legal. United Nations Office of Legal Affairs <laughs>